Hi, my name is Tom Lutz, the inventor of the Rapport Smart Stopper. My wife and I both have two jobs, two young kids, and on a Friday night, we like to come home and enjoy a nice glass of wine. But at the end of the night, what do we do with the leftover wine? If we cork it and come back a couple days or a few days later, it's probably gone bad and we're gonna throw it down the drain. Why does it go bad? Well, oxygen is both a friend and an enemy of wine. In the short term, oxygen helps wine taste better. As time goes on, it starts to deteriorate the wine and it tastes bad. There's a lot of gimmicks on the market today to save wine. Some of them work a little bit, some of them work okay. A lot of them are just gimmicks. I started to think, I'm a PhD chemist. I should find a solution to this. What if we just had a stopper that had something inside of it that selectively absorbed oxygen? It would remove all the oxygen without all those other issues that the other systems have. And that's where the idea came from. Our Rapport Smart Stopper is easy. Simply remove a foil seal and cork your bottle. When you remove the foil seal, an FDA-approved oxygen absorber gets to work. Oxygen in the air above your wine starts to absorb into the system, and in turn, oxygen is degassed out of the wine itself, getting levels down to less than 0.05%. No oxygen, your wine stays good. Over the last year, we've handed out over 100 prototypes to various wine lovers and wine experts to test with rave reviews. Here at Cedar Ridge, our restaurant closes every Sunday, and we don't reopen till Wednesday. In the past, that meant uh, every Sunday we had to pour out hundreds of dollars worth of wine. Now, with the Rapport Smart Stopper, we simply replace the corks with the Smart Stopper when we leave here on Sunday. When we come back Wednesday, the wines are as fresh as they were when we opened them. Instead of pouring bad wine down the drain, for less than a dollar per bottle, the restaurant or bar can save wine waste and turn that wine into profit, as well as open up the cellar for added options to offer their customer. How do you enjoy your wine? Do you have a glass of wine every Friday night? Do you enjoy a Pinot on a Tuesday and a Chardonnay on a Thursday and have multiple bottles of wine open at any given time? Well, one Rapport Smart Stopper keeps one bottle of wine fresh, no matter how many times you open and close that bottle, keeping your wine true to its original taste and aroma. These are designed to be disposable. When you open a new bottle, you open a new Rapport Smart Stopper. It's that simple and that effective. So here's my promise to you. Rapport works every single time. We'll never let your wine go bad, so you never have to worry about it. No oxygen, no wine degradation, no more wine down the drain. We need your help. We have a product that works and works really well. We know what it takes to bring it to market. We just need your support to get it there. As soon as the funding comes in, we can hit go and have product ready by the end of February. We thank you in advance for your support and look forward to having rapport on the market soon. I was 12 years old, I was at a family Christmas party. My aunt turned away a glass of wine because of the sulfites. It wasn't until many years after that and a long time spent learning chemistry in grad school that I realized really what sulfites were and that I had the skills and the education to solve what's a problem for a lot of people. Even today, there's this artisan feel to winemaking. You wake up before dawn, you walk the vineyard rows, you get to work with your hands. And there's something about being connected to the land that constantly reminds you winemaking is a natural process. I've always been told that good wine comes from good grapes, and that's certainly true. But after the grapes leave the vineyard, there's a whole separate process that starts in the winery that most wine drinkers aren't even aware of. More and more vineyards are going organic, and that's great because that means less pesticides and chemicals in our wine. But wineries still need to use preservatives to ensure that wine doesn't go bad during production. One of my first roles at the winery was adding sulfites to the grapes after they were harvested. And that's when I realized how intense these chemicals really are. That being said, I understand the important role they play in modern winemaking on an industrial scale. 
But if I could remove preservatives from my wine before I drank it, I definitely would. Sulfites are an essential preservative in winemaking. They're the reason we can enjoy wines from all over the world. Because without sulfites, the wine would never have survived the trip from the vineyard to your glass. But when you're ready to drink the wine, that job is done. So removing sulfites with ulo lets you bring the wine back to its original state, as if you were drinking it right at the vineyard. This is how ulo works. You pour your wine through, and the sulfites are retained on a filter material, while everything else in the wine just flows right past, completely unaffected. That's selective sulfite capture. And it's important because we want to maintain the original taste and character of the wine and only remove that one thing, sulfites. We know that aeration can be really important for wine. For red wines in particular, it boosts the flavors that are already there. But we know it's not as necessary for white wines. So Ulo had to have the option of turning the aerator on or off. Wine's unique because it works in so many different settings. We can drink it socially, we can have a glass by ourselves. We knew that and designed Ulo to integrate into a glass carafe or decanter if you're serving an entire bottle. But if you're looking to have just a single glass for yourself, it rests on top of your wine glass as well. When developing Ulo, we've worked together to make sure that Ulo always preserves the integrity, the character, and the flavor of any wine. I'm Scott Tavener. I'm Michael Leibowitz. And this is Savino. As a lover of wine and a foodie at heart, I've always been perplexed by the problem of how do you preserve an open bottle so you can continue to pair the right wines with the right meals and keep it fresh longer. When my wife and I first got married, we opened a really nice bottle of wine one Friday night. And the next morning I woke up to find a half glass of wine in the top shelf of the refrigerator. I turned to my wife and said, what's this doing here? And she said, I wanted to preserve it for later. Little did I know that this would set off a 15-year quest to find the perfect wine preservation system. So I call it the tyranny of the 750. Historically, you're either forced to drink an entire bottle of wine, or you end up throwing it away because you can't preserve it. Over the past 15 years, I've tried almost every wine preservation system on the market, from vacuums to smaller vessels to inert gases, and nothing was effective, easy to use, and elegant. So I founded Savino. So I was able to attract the best design team out there, and together we have solved the problem on how you can have a glass of wine on Tuesday and enjoy the rest of the bottle on Saturday. Wine is really a social product. It's meant to be shared with friends and family around the table. And what I love about our product is it both preserves wine and can be brought to the table. So here's how it works. It's three simple steps. First, it's Tuesday. Open yourself a great bottle of wine and pour yourself a, a nice big glass. Take the remaining wine, take your Savino, and go ahead and pour your entire bottle right into the Savino. Then you take your float, you snap it into place, and now you've created a physical barrier so the oxygen can't get to your wine. Take your lid, put that in place, and now you know that it's not going to spill when you put it in your fridge or in your other wine storage area. Now it's Saturday. You remove the top. You pour yourself a fantastic glass of wine. The design is done and we're ready for production. And now we need your help. 
With your support, we can pay for the initial tooling and the first run of this very exciting product, so you too can have a Savino on your table and start enjoying today's wine tomorrow. Hello, my Kickstarter friends. I'm Skip Lee, the inventor of the Tribella Wine Aerator. Aeration is for real. It's simple science, really, not just a bunch of marketing mumbo jumbo. When you think about it, for thousands of years, people have decanted wine, basically poured wine into a very large vessel that has a very large surface area, allowing more wine to touch more air. The process of mixing wine and air allows the wine to open up, which only enhances its beautiful flavor. American innovation has really taken over, and now there are many different devices that are in the market today, all of which are very, very good, and all of which do virtually the same thing, just mixing air and wine together to allow your wine to open up to enrich the flavors of that wine itself. I'm a very simple guy, and when I buy a pretty simple wine to have with my evening meal, I like to use an aerator. But one of the questions I had was, is there a way to make that aeration a more pleasant experience? What I really wanted to do was attempt to complete the circuit between beauty and elegance. I thought, wine is beautiful, a wine glass is beautiful, so why can't the pour and the act of aeration be beautiful as well? So my thought process became absolutely positively crystal clear. Respect the wine, respect the winery, respect the vintner who made the wine, respect the artisan who made your beautiful wine glass. Wine should be a joy, wine should be a passion to enjoy, and consequently you would want your pour and your aeration to be beautiful as well. My Tribella wine aerator is patented, it's trademarked, unfussy, and oh so simple to use. It allows the wine to be beautifully poured in three elegant streams. The ambient air in between the streams allows the wine to open up and naturally breathe while it gracefully falls into your glass. By design also, the Tribella just stays in your bottle, so it makes it very simple to use as well. And by the way, it's drip free. I really hope you fall in love with the Tribella Wine Aerator, much the way I have and many of my families and friends have. Now you can enjoy a beautiful glass of wine in a drip-free way and have wine the way the vintner intended to make it. I want to thank you guys all for watching this video today and please do share this with other of your Kickstarter friends and other of your wine drinking buddies. Cheers. Every year in the UK alone, almost 50 million litres of wine are poured down the plug hole. That's a massive £270 million down the drain.
You know how it is, you crack open that one last bottle with friends the weekend, and then the rest ends up on your kitchen counter for three days, exposed to oxygen, and your vino turns to vinegar. Sure, there's wine preservation devices out there, but they're either ineffective, as the wine is still in contact with some air, or expensive, and you're tied into pricey refills. Which got me thinking, there had to be a better way to preserve your wine's full flavour, no matter how much you had left. So I came up with Etor. Simple, elegant, and it really works. Here's how. Decant your whole bottle into Etor, this opens up the wine and brings out its character. Pour yourself a glass, the sharp lip gives drip-free pouring. But then here's the magic. Push down on the neck and the unique patented design forms a complete seal, preventing any further contact with oxygen to preserve your wine's full flavour. Ideally, store Eto in the fridge to keep both white and red in perfect condition until you decide it's time for another glass. Then simply tip Eto and the innovative valve automatically opens as you pour. No gases, no pumping that can strip wine of its flavour, just good practical design. To test its preservation capability, we took our prototypes to the laboratories of Bangor University. We tested Eto against leaving wine in a cork bottle and a number of other well-known preservation solutions. The results were indisputable. Eto far outperformed them all. I was really amazed and I have to say surprised when I first tried it. I couldn't believe that a wine which had been decanted into it seven days beforehand tasted every bit as fresh as a wine which had come from a recently opened bottle. But it also had the added benefits of decanting in that the wine was breathing, it was opening up, it was tasting absolutely delicious. We've built over 60 prototypes tested to achieve the perfect seal and simplify Eto for easy cleaning and assembly. It's also been designed for durability and all materials are of the highest quality, all rigorously tested to ensure they have no effect on the wine's flavour. We're a self-funded startup, experienced in product development, but we now need your help to bring Eto to market. The manufacturers are ready to go so choose your reward, and by pledging, you'll be one of the first to enjoy perfect wine every time and never waste a drop again. Cheers.